The NFL Draft is now on the clock. A three-day affair getting started earlier tonight in Chicago, and there could be a distinct scarlet and gray hue to the proceedings. Over a dozen former Ohio State players could be drafted at some point, and perhaps as many as five or six in tonight's first round. Buckeye Nation did not have to wait long as defensive end Joey Bozo went to San Diego in the third pick of the draft, the highest Buckeye to be selected since Orlando Pace went number one overall 19 years ago. In that same draft, Buckeyes had two of the top three this year. They newly, nearly duplicate that feat as Bozo's former roommate Ezekiel Elliott was the next player selected. The running back picked up by Dallas with the number four overall selection. Elliott is the highest drafted Buckeye running back in 60 years. Heisman Trophy winner Hopalong Cassidy went to the Lions high in 56. Buckeyes weren't done in the first round either as cornerback Eli Apple goes to the New York Giants at number 10. The New Jersey native going back home, the third Buckeye in the top 10. And two more Buckeyes would be drafted. Lions take Taylor Decker at 16. The Jets take Darren Lee at number 20. Meanwhile, the Cleveland Browns, after trading down from the two spot, traded down once again, swapping first round picks with Tennessee and also picking up another third rounder this year. With that first rounder this year, or tonight I should say, the Browns pick up Corey Coleman, the receiver out of Baylor, the Bolitnikoff winner this past year in college football. Great to see so many Buckeyes will be able to watch next year.